Imperial to Rome is fully moddable. It's important for us to empower the community with powerful tools in order for them to modify the game as they see fit and create their own experience of the classical era. Imperator has the most advanced modding tools you've ever seen in a Paradox game. Besides having a map editor and a GUI editor, it has enormous capabilities and you can create pretty much anything for the modding language. You can change the province layout, you can change the environment and go from a forest to a desert if you'd like. The modding language in Imperator has uh, things like fully functional variables, you have loops, units, their actions to characters and their interactions. Pretty much everything is controlled from this modding language. It's a very empowering tool. Another technological advancement that we've made is we've upgraded the technology for the characters. So where they before were just 2D dimensional characters that were built by layers, they're now fully 3D characters where all parts of the faces are dynamic. Uh, so now skin, eye color and hair color can blend dynamically. The appearance of characters is actually stored in a set of genes that each character has. The appearance of a new character is inherited from his father and mother's genes. Creating the system has actually taken several years and the work for the artist to create the portraits is challenging in itself. The passion for me in creating games comes from just working with other talented people in creating something that we can release to our fans. I'm very excited about this release because Imperator Rome is a game that has been requested a lot by our community. The community is at the very core of our value at Paradox. We value their input and we are always super excited to provide them with a new title and a new game. I expect a lot of fun stuff from the community after the release of Imperator. I expect to see fun Let's Plays and after action reports. I expect people to find cool exploits where they basically paint the map in two days. I want to see everything. It's going to be so fun and most importantly, it, I just can't wait to see the reactions of people and seeing how they enjoy playing the game.